Hi, this month I've decided to paint houses, so this is my process so far and I will be showing you guys a how-to of my last four drawings of houses. Um, so this is just a small flip through so you guys can see what I've done and uh, how I went from more complicated to more simple and then from clean to just dirty and messy paintings anyways um getting into it i pretty much use google earth to look up houses and normally if i find one that i fancy that i like that i would see myself living into i just go ahead and paint it now some of them are fancy some of them are not so and actually if it would be of my choice um I do prefer smaller spaces, I do not like very big spaces even though I do like the open ones, so one thing I like very much is big windows, that's like my first go to thing, it has to have, a house has to have big windows, if not I feel kind of claustrophobic. Anyways, so every month I normally choose a subject that I'm not very comfortable with. Well, other times I do choose something that I'm comfortable with, but something that I just love painting or drawing. And just to challenge myself, I try to find new ways of drawing. So I'm not really good at drawing buildings and uh, houses. And I've decided to start off strong and to dedicate January to painting houses. There is this YouTuber that I really, really love and I look up to, um, Mini Small, and uh, she's great at drawing houses. And ever since I saw her Inktober zines, if I'm not mistaken, uh, I just fell in love with the way she's so, so easy. She makes it seem so easy. So I've always said that, well, I should give it a try, but then I end up never doing it. So, yeah. This year I wanted to start strong so I forced myself to draw half a page every day. So you here pretty much see the span of uh, four days. Well actually normally you see the same lighting, lightning it's because I do it at night. <laughs> because it's the only time I get to paint. So uh, what can I tell you guys is that um, I'm trying to get comfortable with the concept and I'm trying to learn better ways of drawing. Now I know these are uh, kid worth, <laughs> not even kid worth of uh, paintings because they're very messy and I do not care so much for execution. I actually want to get comfortable painting them. So yes, um, you guys can see I have different ways of approaching paintings. Um, these last two have been more loose and then halfway through I changed my mind maybe. So I just like to keep it simple. And well, this is pretty much what you see. Uh, most of these paintings are done on uh, the cheapest sketchbook I could find. <laughs> so the quality of paper is not good. Uh, I'm using my Van Gogh and my White Knights watercolors to paint so the quality of the paint is good but well it kind of makes up a little bit for for the paper <laughs> but anyways um this is what i've pretty much done this month um, apart from other paintings uh, lately i just find myself not wanting to edit videos so well i guess i'll just give you guys more flip throughs instead of showing you actual processes but yeah I hope you guys like it and I'll see you whenever I upload a new video. I hope you guys enjoy. Bye.